Oscar, the 6'3 junior from Tucson, Arizona, number 10, Austin Nels. For 56 years, Central Connecticut sports fans have enjoyed the golden tones of the voice of the Blue Devils. Public address announcer Joe Arnone. The 1959 Central grad, or Teachers College of Connecticut as it was known then, was a former Blue Devils football player. I spent uh, 35 years teaching in the public school system. And all my activities here were on a part-time basis. I taught in the evening college for about 25 years. His public address duties started innocently enough. In 1962, uh, Bill Moore asked me to come back and help coach football, baseball, and do some sports publicity work. He wasn't even the first choice for PA. Bill Moore wanted to have a professional, a media professional, doing that. After a couple of uh, games, he couldn't make it because of his duties at the radio station, so I took over. Had you had any experience doing that at all, or was it no. kind of like, here's the mic, go do what you got to do? Yeah. Right. Bill Moore brought in former WTIC great Arnold Dean, who heard Joe. That was Davon Barnett with the basket. Bill told me later, he said, Arnold said that we don't need him anymore. <laughs> you got the job. <laughs> so I ended up with the job. And the rest is 56 years of incredible Blue Devils history. Last Saturday, Joe was honored between the men's and women's games with St. Francis of Brooklyn. Arnone may not man the microphone anymore, but that doesn't mean Joe is going anywhere. Oh, you'll see me here, yeah. I'll be Ron Pringle's buddy up there. Ron Pringle's number one spectator. I'll be number two.